today I'm going to show you how to plant a bare root rose in a pot or container. Here in the UK, bare root rose can be planted any time between mid-October and the end of April. For planting you will need your bare root rose, a bucket of water, some John Innes number three, some multi-purpose compost, some crocs at the bottom of your pot, your mycorrhizal fungi, a watering can, your pot or container, a spade and a pair of gloves. Choosing where to place your rose, take into consideration how much sunlight it will receive. We recommend a minimum of four hours per day during the growing season. If it's a fragrant rose, think about placing it somewhere you'll get the most enjoyment from its scent, such as near a walkway or by a seating area. Choosing the right pot or container is key to having a happy and thriving plant. For a shrub rose, we recommend a minimum width and depth of 45 centimetres by 45 centimetres and make sure there's drainage holes at the bottom. Take care when choosing the material of your pot or container. Dark pots look lovely, but they do absorb more heat, so be prepared to water more frequently. The first thing you do is take your bare rose out of the packaging and soak the roots in a bucket of water for two hours to ensure the rose is thoroughly hydrated. If you're adding crocs, place them in the bottom of the pot now. Next, prepare your planting mix by mixing the Johnny's number no. three and the multi-purpose compost together at a ratio of 50-50. Now start to fill your pot with the potting mix. Occasionally firm as you go to remove any air pockets and stop when the pot gets half full. Next, position your row centrally in the pot, making sure the union is two inches below the rim level. We always recommend sprinkling our David Austin mycorrhizal fungi on the roots. This creates a better root system and nutrient uptake, which results in a more abundant flowering rose. Once you're happy with the depth of the rose and it's sat centrally in the pot, continue adding the potting mix. Make sure to firm as you go to remove any air pockets. Finally, once your rose is firmly planted, give it a generous watering in. If the weather is particularly warm, dry or windy in the immediate weeks after you've planted your rose, keep an eye on it and water again if needed. It really is that easy to plant a bare root rose in a pot and whilst it may not look much now, it will soon undergo an amazing transformation.